When you're 16, somebody tells you they love you, you're gonna believe them. 15 seconds. And you're 16. <laughs> Was that 15? Okay. Good afternoon and welcome to Audio Tree Live. Today is Thursday, November 29th, 2018, and we're so honored to have with us in the studio Sen Morimoto. Take it away when you guys are ready. Feeling from my phone, fill up on empty and alone. Finish your final, made it home. Believe a message at the tone. Beautiful, better space to be in. I didn't miss it and I mean it. I know an ugly frame of mind. It loves, I told you so, and fine. Beautiful, stupid imperfection. Section. I hope we catch up at the next one Next intersection I was a minute away from I was a minute away from
You're watching Audio Tree Live. We're in the studio with Sen Morimoto. What's up, everybody? Thank you so much for coming out. You can go ahead and go to that next one, Thank and then you. we'll chat. We will chat. Watching Audio Tree Live in the studio with Sen Morimoto. Could you tell me a little bit about this trip to Japan that y'all took as a band? Was that for a festival? Like yeah. a, a festival in Tokyo, is that right? Yeah, uh, cool. it's called Summer Sonic. It's like outside Tokyo in Chiba. Okay. Uh, and uh, yeah, it was my first time playing in Japan. Cool. And so it was really dope to be able to bring my friends. and. Yeah. How uh, long were you guys out there? We were only there for like three days. Okay, uh, so first, a real quick trip. Yeah, just it was to really do quick. We tried to like pack as much in as we could. The first day, like Kaina, like booked this or planned this whole house party at this uh, <laughs> collective in Japan that does like uh, DJ beat stuff. Okay, cool. That was really dope. It was like a party. My dad came and. Oh <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good time, and then we did the festival the next day, and then the day after we had a um, we had a show at like a club. And then we flew right back the next day after that. Crazy. But it sounds really fun then. Yeah. So, yeah, it, it, your dad lives out there. Do you have other family oh, out no, there my, as well? My dad lives in Massachusetts, oh, but okay. I got to fly him out for the show. And oh, that was cool. cool. He had never really seen me play music before yeah. like that. So, uh, what that was, was his dope. review? He liked it. I think he was excited. It was, uh, uh, yeah, he was like, you should play more saxophone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. He's like, you sing really high. <laughs> I like those very uh, like parental reviews, I yeah, feel like. Yeah. Uh, uh, any good food? Yeah, you know, we had some good ramen. My brother li does live in, he lives in Kyoto, but okay. he, he was working in Tokyo while we were there, and um, he hung out with us, and he always takes me to like places with really weird food. He's into like weird food, but he okay. doesn't say, he doesn't give any warning. Yeah, he doesn't say so, this like, is about to be a weird experience. Right, like He's everyone like, hey, was really hungry. Yeah. Right, it was late. I was like, we're looking for food. He was like, oh, I got just the place. Don't even worry about it. Don't even, so I didn't ask him about it. We got there. He was like, you want to, you ever had a, a fish, a pregnant fish full of <laughs> like fish row inside of a raw fish? And I was like, you like, these guys want no. some, like, <laughs> these guys want some ramen. <laughs> yeah. They just want some, like, really, really well-made rice. Like, Everyone you don't like, need pregnant right. fish. Everyone was like, like, I'm hungry. And then the food came out. I was like, you know, I'm not that hungry. <laughs> <laughs> 
it was, <laughs> yeah. We, we tried. tried. <laughs> we tried. We tried it, yeah. Everyone. Good. Yeah, at least you're good sports about it, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Shout uh, out to you, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, thanks again for coming out. You can go into that next set. All right. This one's called I Just Spoke to Mama. Features Kaina. you 
thought of. Tell me a little bit about the uh, set design on the album cover. I saw like a, an interview with a bunch of camera roll photos, and that was like from your something that you created, I suppose, or um, interview with a bunch of camera roll photos. Yeah. Um, so I made the set. It's like a diorama. Yeah. Um, that I uh, I got the idea from. There's this video uh, that I really <laughs> like on the YouTubes <laughs> of. I can't, I can't even think of his name right now. Oh, Peter Drake. It's, oh, Pete Drake yeah, called yeah. Forever. And it's a set that they made for this one live performance on TV. And uh, I was just, I watched over and over again, and I just love how the set is kind of like weirdly like janky, how it's yeah, crafted. Yeah, like lopsided so, a bit. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. So I just tried to make something like that out of clay and uh, went to Joanne's and... Crafts are expensive. Dude, they're so expensive. <laughs> like like calligraphy pens, something right. like pretty simple. I got everything from Very the kids expensive. section. Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> You're um, like, yeah, well, maybe this is cheaper. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then my friend Megan helped me take the photos of it. And cool. then my roommate, Ed, helped me like put it all together. So it's kind of like a um, I'm photoshopped into the diorama. Yeah, right, right. And uh, yeah, and then for the video for the next song we're going to do, actually, how right. it is... Um, my friends Jake and Bailey made the video with me, and they built they built the diorama, but like life size. Okay. So yeah, that was really fun. That's maybe what you're talking about. Yeah, that yeah, that's yeah, that that might have been it. I I didn't exactly know like what the photos were from, but right. yeah, the the video is crazy cool. I love like all the like. I don't know, reality bending kind of stuff. You're like reaching into that, uh, just a log, and then there's a cube, and then all of a sudden you're like in another <laughs> room, a bunch of colors, and then that's all that stuff's really cool. Yeah. Is that like, uh, was that your treatment, like your idea or other friends? Uh, friends ideas yeah, Jake and Bailey uh, run, a, they have their video company called Low Moon Video. Okay. Everyone check it out. They do a bunch of cool music videos. Yeah. And so basically, I just came to them with the basic outline of what I wanted the story of the video to be, and they helped me kind of create these trippy scenes. Okay. And, uh, yeah, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. Speaking of music videos, the the one for Cannonball, you're in like a really cool like, is that a crater like some volcano such yeah. thing? Yeah. Uh, my sister lives on Maui, okay, and cool. so there's a, a crater called Haleakala. Yeah. Uh, that's like, ten thousand feet in the air. You like drive up and you hike into it. Wow. And so my brother uh, makes uh, videos. He makes like short films of his own. Does sure. a lot of like video work. So um, he helped me make a video in there. It's, yeah, it's a really beautiful spot. It felt a little bad. When I stepped out, I got sick, like, immediately. Like, I got a fever, and I thought oh. maybe it was, like, I was cursed for oh. shooting in a sacred <laughs> land. It was so bad. I, love, I like, I passed love, out. <laughs> what I thought you were going to say is, like, you inhaled some ash or something. But no, You went straight cursed. to curse. You must have been cursed. It couldn't have been anything reasonable. Yeah. I mean, in all the, I suppose you didn't have to ask people to, like, get out of the way, right? Because it's all just, like, it's, all open space Yeah, it's down huge. There? You run yeah. into people every once in a while, but okay. it's so big that you never, it's like you hike 12 miles inside of it. Yeah. And then, yeah, it's... It's crazy. I've it's never crazy. seen like a yeah volcanic stuff. Are those rocks like really hard and sharp? Like all the rocks that you were walking over? Some of them. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, it's that's cool. all. There's a lot of different <laughs> climates kind of. There's like a deserty part and a kind of more woodsy area. Sure, sure. It's cool. Was that your first time out in Hawaii? No, I uh I've been there twice, maybe three times. Okay. My cool. sister's been living there a while now. Is it all it's like cut out to be like extremely beautiful and oh, it, yeah. really worth going to? It's fucked up. It's okay. paradise. You go there and you're like, what am I doing? Why? <laughs> Why are people allowed to live here? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Cool. Uh, thanks for sharing. Going to your next song. Thank you. Mm. Two, three. Mm. <laughs> Ice, ice, ice me out, tell me how it is. Tell me 
on a new type of medicine It's working but it's not as fun as pot But that just put me back in my head again That just put me back in my spot And that just made me say things I said again Then again everything's part of the reason we talk Conversation is one of those things that we lost Sight of and light of a light in the dark Then again when was the last intelligent conversation you had That didn't have you lost Like everything's nothing and everything's not And I'm walking the dog, yo, yo, mom in the park I'm talking to God through the roof and the bark On the tree in the yard, all I need is a spark A light in the dark, pick up a pen and write in your name and pull me apart I want nothing to do with this People are all mixed up, they won't make you quit I never take advice, I size me out, tell me how it is Tell me, why you disguise yourself? What if we don't work hard? They say we don't exist What did you think this was? I size me out Watching Audio Tree Live in the studio with Sen Morimoto. Would you tell me a little bit about, like, um, I suppose the journey through instruments? Because you play so many and you play them all so well. Like, how did you start, kind of? Was, was sax the first instrument that you were taught or that you learned? Yeah, I picked up sax when I was 10. Okay. Um, so that's the one I've been doing the longest. I just turned 25 a couple okay, days yeah, ago. Okay, yeah, so 15 years. Nice. And Happy birthday. Thank you. Yes. That's what I was looking for. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what uh, I really wanted to <laughs> yeah. And, uh, yeah, and then the rest of them, that, like, I took sax lessons growing up till I was, like, maybe 17 or something. And okay. the rest of them I just kind of learned because I wanted to play different kinds of music. Like, yeah, um, I'd learn piano, trying to play, like, R&B stuff. Or yeah. I'm trying to learn guitar now. It's really hard. Yeah, do you think that the skills, like, transfer to one another at all? I mean, that instrument seems so, everybody plays clarinet, which I know isn't the same, but like, he, he just always talks about how delicate it all is, like with the reeds and like, I don't know, yeah. the temperature of the room and all that stuff. A guitar just seems like a, I mean, I don't know, you just I play I don't know, it. temperature of the room can fuck shit up with it. Yeah, I, I suppose. Not be swear, I've been swearing the whole time. <laughs> no, you're okay. You can, <laughs> you can swear if you want, that's fine. I really want to. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, saxophone. I think mainly learning piano was really big because that just helped me like visualize where everything lays oh, okay. harmonically. Sure. And sure. Um, but yeah, a lot of things, especially in terms of like singing, learning how to sing and stuff, and how to use my voice. A lot of it is related. Like I'm thinking in saxophone. Okay. You know. Got like, it. Yeah. Like yeah. Like it's a second language. Kind yeah, of that's kind of like thing. your lens then to to peer everything. Oh, that's yeah. interesting. Yeah, thinking of like saxophone as the language that translates to all the other instruments for sure. Yeah. Um, I'm just curious if you wanted to introduce the band. I don't want. Uh, I don't want to. Yeah. I don't want anyone to know who they are. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. Absolutely. To my right, this is Kaina. She Hi. sings <laughs> and makes amazing music on her own. Everyone here does actually makes dope shit. Uh, this is Brian on guitar. Wait, is there? Oh, there's a camera on him already. <laughs> Brian on, this is Brian Sanborn on guitar. This is Dejan Crockren on bass, and Ryan Person on drums. Great. Blessed to have them here. Dude, yeah, it's awesome. It really sounds so great in here. So thanks you guys again. Yeah, thank you guys. I'm sorry. I... <laughs> <laughs> you can do you can do that last set uh, okay. when you're geared up. All right, let's do it. Um, Y'all ready? Yep. La 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 la. La 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 Uh huh In balls, shallow, small, evil Moonlit laughter cause the sun shadows all people Hoops in a row for jumping through Get something new ways Wish for change, it's a phase Is the moon's favorite turn of phrase Deep and cannonball, shallow, small, evil Moonlit laughter cause the sun shadows all Hoops in a row for jumping through Get something new ways Reconstruct 
worked it overnight In 24 I wasted time I never want to go outside I love a saint that lets me relate To this day I have a level with the time Okay. And this is just a moment, time and space. I finally lost it. Yay! This is only this, and that's okay. I finally lost it. It took so long to find, and it cost me. I lost track of time, let the clock tick. I just dropped my keys in the mosh pit. Can't It's a magic trick Flash a light into my eyes and say I squint Segments of my life in which I might have maybe did Include a church when they said pray And all I really did was sit Or in a memory in which I'm in the mirror And I think, think I maybe even winked And said you're stupid, it's a thing I say you're adorable but you are not a door You don't have to open anymore I can't involve right through the floor like
That's not how it Morimoto, you can uh, check them out on tour. They're going out with La 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 starting January 18th through February 2nd and get Cannonball, the newest release, out now on Super. 
Uh, thank you, seriously, so much for performing thank for you, us. Thank you, Blake. Thank you yeah. so much, Audio Tree. Yeah, thanks to awesome people in the studio and sound engineers, camera and lighting crew for making it look beautiful. And viewers, thanks for watching. You can support the band by downloading or streaming the session when it comes out in a couple of weeks and send a shout by social media to us or them if you just want to connect. From all of us here at the Audio Tree Studios, thanks for tuning in. Goodbye. All right, so you guys want to do it for real now?